hello everyone welcome back to new view i am here um you know honestly i do kind of have a channeled message okay um don't let anything get you down right now i i feel like that's kind of the theme today maybe um started yesterday around this new moon energy right um i feel like too this is a time of of self-reflection you know for me personally I usually feel the the moon phases for about four days. I always tell people that, I, and it's true. I feel it a couple of days before that moon phase, and I feel it a couple of days after. So I feel like we're still in that energy. Um, and maybe you have been doing some self-reflection, looking back on things from the past, because we're releasing now and moving on. Things are about to start moving really, really quickly as well. But when we talk about new moon energy, I always feel like the new moons are when we want to pull in the new stuff, okay? So right now, it's really important that you don't let anything get you down, okay? <laughs> At least try, I know. Um, that's a tough, it's a tough thing to do, but, but try to stay focused on the things that you want in your life and make them positive things, okay? Anyway, collective, this reading, it may not be for all of you. Um, just take what resonates, leave the rest behind, right? And thank you so much, everyone. We're growing this channel from the ground up. It quickly became a lightworker channel. That's the direction the divine wanted to take it. I had nothing to do with that one. <laughs> they just brought us all together. So um, thank you so much, you guys. For, uh, for helping me grow this channel from the ground up. It's my second channel out here. I'm super jazzed about it. Um, I just like seeing the, um, the soul tribe grow, right? I like seeing us expand and I like being out here kind of helping to give the light workers. I, I can get, you know, you guys are just as powerful as, as any other light worker out here, right? I mean, and I feel like we're just kind of in it together, you know? We're in it together. So I like giving you these messages from the divine. It helps lead all of us as a, as a team. Okay. Um, so yeah, I'm really jazzed about this. And hey, if you're interested in, um, in your zodiac sign readings, right? I do all the individual readings for all the signs over on my main channel, Lumen Moon Tarot. Okay, just so you know. All right, so collective. Divine, what do you have for my beautiful collective today? Messages for my collective. Okay, yeah, and we were just talking about the pillar of leadership. Um, and you help to lead others, but here on this channel, we work together as a group, okay? Um, yeah, I am a leader. I speak in confidence with authority. I lead by example. Uh, I am a pillar of character that holds the weight of responsibility for my people. And that's how you feel. Like, um, you lead by example. And to me, yeah, you may be a leader, but we're all in this together. Like, you're able to lead by example. Um, you're doing the same thing that, that you're leading other people to do, okay? Um, so, yeah, it's still, still, we're working together as a team here, guys. Um, it's the divine, the collective energy, all of us together, right? Working together. Uh, jewel of the Lotus and happy heart. Um, I am transcendent. Emerging from the veiled depths, I unfurl my essence petal by petal as I open myself to the divine light within grows brighter. Um, the divine light grows brighter revealing the truth that i am a precious jewel yeah and i feel like you stand out above the crowd like you know what else i'm feeling like here is people are clearly seeing who you are and what you can do this is when all the light workers now you know we're kind of like we come to a huddle here right <laughs> we huddle we talk about the plan right um what moves we're going to make next what's coming towards us and then it's it's like you're exposed here um you're you're you you go to your places right and you and you're revealed to everyone okay um that's kind of the feeling like that i'm getting here it's um yeah 
you're being shown to somebody I, you know I'm seeing happy heart here but what I'm actually what I'm actually looking at here in this picture it looks like to me it's a bleeding heart okay this could be your energy you know you're able to lead because of all the heartache and the betrayal and everything everything good and bad that you've experienced in your life right you have that knowledge because you have that experience and that's how you're a good leader for other people. You know how to get them from that heartache to their healing and to a new life. We're all out here as light workers. I feel divine feminine, divine masculine energies, whatever you're doing to help other people and raise their vibrations and help them heal, man, you're being spiritually led. Okay? And we're all... I'm hearing handyman. I'm your handyman, right? Um, I want to say his name is James Taylor, but correct me if I'm wrong. I'm not really sure. I might need a lifeline on this one. Um, I think that's who sings the song. I'm your handyman by, I think it's James Taylor. Um, you fix broken hearts. I know, but you truly can, okay? That's what you're doing out here. Because you have the experience, because you have the knowledge, you're able to take those lessons and the things that you learned, the things that helped you to survive through all of this and help other people um, make their way through it as well, okay? And so this is why the divine, this is that time now to show all of the light workers. So it almost feels like a big presentation for you, okay? as a leader a spiritual leader some of you could have gotten some kind of confirmation about this too that you've passed some kind of test that you've passed maybe you're even um opening up more to like mediumship i've been picking up on that a lot too like expanding your abilities and your um your skills right your knowledge um, but yeah, I'm just, I, I know it says happy heart, but I feel like you've been through heartache. This is coming from, you may, you, you know how to heal that bleeding heart. That's kind of the feeling I'm getting off of this card. I have a, a happy heart. Today will be full of joyful moments waiting for me to discover. My gratitude overflows from my inner self to those around me. And that's what I'm talking about. You know, that's that raising people's vibrations, being thankful for everything that you've been led through, right? But that's the whole part. You, light worker, you, divine feminine, divine masculine, you know that you've been spiritually led. That's why you're on the front line as a light worker fighting against negativity, okay? You have that faith. And as you can see, not only can you tell people, I know, I've been through it, I will help you through it too, but you tell people, I've been through it because the divine took me by the hand and led me through it. Okay? You give them, you totally give the divine credit in this, all credit in this. And that is why you were a light worker. And that is why you've got expo exposure now in your life. Everybody is starting to know who you are. Okay? They can see who you are. And you walk in faith. And combining those two things together, right? Not only saying to be, you're able to say to people, I've been through it. I've been through it. I've been through the same thing. Come on. I'll show you, I'll help you learn how to heal. I'll show you this process, right? Or I'll inspire you to heal or start this process on your own, however you want to look at it. Not only can you tell them I've been, I've been through it myself, but you can tell them I've been through it myself with the divine leading me, with God leading me. You're telling people you, in order to, you combine both right both of these concepts together and it is your reality because it's true you are being spiritually led it's true beyond the shadow of a doubt at this point i feel for most of us in this in um where we are now on this journey on this channel i feel like we know who we are okay and if you're new to this channel stick with us man if you found us we will help you through it 
we will help you through this because we've been spiritually led and we've been through it ourselves and we you know what we know what we're doing when it comes to the process and we'll help lead you okay see that's what i'm talking about this is what i'm talking about <laughs> right um but yeah so you're it's almost like the divine is presenting you showing everyone that you're a leader here and this is why because of what you've been through and because you know you've been led through it by God, by your spiritual team, okay? Yes, this is why. It's your faith. You're, it's like you're walking proof, right, of what spirit can do in your life if you just surrender to them, okay? Um, yeah, you're helping people mend. This is what I'm talking about. You're helping people mend. You're helping them take time for themselves, look down inside, ask themselves the questions that they need to ask themselves. That's just where it starts. It starts here. Doing that inner work. And you help people. You inspire them enough to take a look at themselves. Do you know how hard that is to get somebody to do? And you're able to do it because you walk in faith and you know what it is that you're talking about. Okay, cleaning it up. Clarify cleaning it up. Ooh, my stomach just growled. So maybe somebody needs to clean up their diet a little bit. I'm guilty of that too. Um, yeah, I can't get myself off of my daily shake. I have a daily milkshake, okay? I do. <laughs> I'll drive to the convenience store and I'll have a daily milkshake and I call it my Vitamita Vegemin, okay? So, yeah, I'm not judging anybody there on that one. Um, yeah, here's you, you're, you know what, this is what it is. You help people heal. I fix broken hearts, I know. But I truly can, right? Um, you help them clear out energy. You help them get rid of the things that um, no longer serve them, right? So that they can move forward. You help people who may feel stuck um, between the past and the future. You heal people. You're a healer, you know? You're a healer. And now I feel like now it's a time in your life here where, and this is what it is too. Look at what you do for people. And you've been through the same thing, okay? You, my leaders out here, my light workers, you've been through the same thing feeling orphaned, feeling broken, feeling stuck in stagnancy, okay? Maybe even stuck in your head. You've had to look at yourself here too. We all have. We all have. Um, you've, you've gone from being orphaned to being ready to receive a brand new beginning and being held on a pedestal. Look at this, up on a pedestal. This is, this is that transformation that you're leading people in, right? Feeling like this, left behind and orphaned and alone and sad to knowing that you're truly blessed. Oh, I'm getting the chills. Knowing that you're truly blessed, being able to forgive and release pains, all of this pain. Look at this transformation. Look at this change with the five here. Yep, I'm telling you, this is your spiritual path too. Look at this, five, five. A 44, that's an 1111, divine number. Yeah, this is what you do for the divine. You help people to release so they can truly be blessed. That's what this is. Release this energy, this orphaned, left behind kind of energy, and be open to receive the blessings. You help people come closer to the divine. You inspire them here and you get them through their healing. You fix broken hearts, I know, but you truly can. You know? 
Yeah. All right, so what else can you show me? What messages? Yeah, to be fair. Um, I feel like the divine, this is universal energy. The divine has seen everything that you do. I, I feel like you help people bring them, you help bring people to their balance after excruciating pain. Like you have no idea. Maybe some of you don't even know how much you help other people. This is a purpose for you. You help them get, and it's all because you're between worlds, but you help them get from this energy to this energy. You see that? You heal them. You mend people. And it's because you're between worlds. You've got one foot in on the 3D. You've got one foot on the 5D. You're a muse. You're an inspiration. You're earth angel energy. You're a light worker. Okay? Wearing that crown. <laughs> right? Leading people from a dark energy into something that's way better into wish fulfillment into healing and living a happy life and releasing the pain okay not to mention forgiving sometimes the unforgivable you help people go to calmer waters you could be a libra you could be a cancer pisces scorpio you could be a taurus virgo capricorn You could be any sign, okay? But that is what you do. And I feel like, you know, here's the thing. We've all been in this kind of together, right? We've all been going through these experiences. So now I feel light workers, divine feminines, divine masculines, my collective out here, right? If you found this channel, right? You're poised and ready now to um, receive blessings. You're starting a whole new life here. I feel like, and you're ready. You're ready for this, okay? Yep, and you're starting to put in the work here too, um, knowing that you're blessed or you've been putting in this effort, right? Doing your work. You're about to be blessed. Um, yes, you are. Okay, so give me just one more for my beautiful collective. This one's good. Round and round. Yep, the community. Some of you are being led to a whole new community. I, I'm, I've been picking up on a house move, a location change. This is travel. This is travel. This is a whole new community here. So I feel like, yeah, lightworkers, you know, um, divine beings, we're, we're being led from place to place so we can reach people. And if we can't reach those people and, and they don't open um, to the, they're not open to the messages and the healing, right, in a specific community, I feel like the divine will lead you to the people that you can actually reach that will listen, okay, that you can help. All right, because you're here with that with that big purpose here of um, fixing broken hearts, bringing on awareness, awakening people, inspiring people, raising their vibrations. You know, how take it how it resonates with you, right? This is too many though. Yeah, I feel like you're being led in a different direction. Yep, some of you are, are going to be facing a house move soon. What's on the bottom of the deck? On the bottom of the deck is a new home. Okay, so um, yeah, you can look forward to that in the future if it's not already happening for you, right? Um, a whole new community so that you can continue to do, um, you know, do your purpose, right? Be, be on your path and help mend other people, okay? Yeah. Wow. These readings always get so deep. You guys, I love this soul tribe, man. Thank you so much. I hope this reading helps. Um, if you like this video, please hit that like button, right? Subscribe to my channel, right? To join this awesome soul tribe. And until next time, everyone, take care of you and peace out.